I told my kids that if I get the rooms set up today, they could come and sleep here tonight. It's coming together, guys. It's coming together. standing in Reese and Perry's new bedroom. I got the mirror, it's not, this is not where it's gonna go. But this was, this was Tessie's old mirror, and I'm not even sure where I'm gonna place it. Um, the person lived here before had like three different pictures that went there, and so I just hung it right here for a second so it's not on the ground. But I am putting together Reese and Perry's bedrooms right now. Corey's actually helping me. These are their new beds, it's kind of a gray. It's so cute, I cannot wait for you guys to see their room when it gets together. I got Sophie over here, Lucy came with me. I told my kids that if I get the rooms set up today, they could come and sleep here tonight. We slept at our parents, my parents' house last night, and so we didn't get to move in directly over like we wanted to because we had to close today on this house. It's all good, I'm glad we're here finally. I was so excited though. I woke up this morning, just put a baseball cap on, and now I'm here. I'm so excited to set the rooms up and I cannot wait for you guys to be a part of this. That part is done for now. We're still in boxes everywhere. Um, we did get the furniture in though, I'm really excited. I did tell you guys, I did buy some furniture from the lady who previously lived here. She was an interior designer, she was amazing. Had beautiful, beautiful style. And so I bought some of the furniture and then we had some delivered here. So I got some up. I'll give you like a little sneak peek. There's Kesley's room. It's not all the way done, I'm not gonna go more than that. And we still have to set up Rhett's bed. And this is just half of his stuff right here. These were hers and I did get those. That's not how this is gonna be, but I set that there for now. So I got his mattress here. I just need to get his bed put together. Corinne and I will do that later. And yes, so this is gonna be Rhett's room. I'm really excited to get it decorated and put together as well. I can't wait for you guys to see the reveal of this. I just can't wait for them to see it. I think I'm more excited about that. Corey and I literally just lifted this upstairs by ourselves. I did this all by myself, guys. Do you realize how heavy this is? And I still have to go get the washer. This one was light, I mean, well, lighter compared to the washing machine. I'm so nervous about it. Anyway, I'm gonna go grab that. Hopefully, I can do it. Okay, so here's the craziness of my bedroom. Corona brought all this up by ourselves. And I'm proud to say by myself, you guys, because we were gonna do a mover, but I'm not gonna lie. It was really nice not having to worry about a mover because I didn't wanna pay for it. And we did it, and I'm getting my workout. So I'm feeling pretty good. I gotta put all of my clothes away. I haven't really set up my shelves yet in my little area here. I, this picture was already here in the house, and I, she's like, do you want it? I'm like, sure, I'll keep it. I put Sophia here, and look, Lucy's staring at her. But I did pull out of my little box. This is Logan's hand. I showed it in my other video. So I ha I'm making like a little shrine of memory of Logan. I'm so excited to be able to put this together and make it cute. And you guys, look, she will not stop staring at that bird. I'm not gonna leave the bird here. I'm gonna move her somewhere else, like probably in Reese and Perry's room. But I wanted her to be following me everywhere we go because I, I feel like it's a little warmer out here than it was in their room. So I wanted her to be where there's noise and stuff. Anyway, okay, gotta get going and do more things. Made it downstairs, I'm in the kitchen now. I am going to be unboxing and putting things away. I've already started. I bought some things from Amazon and I'll link them down below. I'm gonna actually organize this really good. I'm Right now I'm just putting the food in here and then once I see what I have, I'm gonna decide what containers will be what. Okay, you guys see all this? Yeah, it keeps going. I have so much to do still. I want to show you guys something really cool. This is from Betty's Bedding. And, okay, you know how we all have the little, you know, bed skirts on our beds, okay? And you know how sometimes they, like, come down or they move up or whatever? I love Betty's because, look, guys, it's attached. You wrap it around, you know, and then this never moves. It's like, look, I'm tugging on it, and it will never move. It will never come down. I just wanted to show you guys that. If you guys want to, you can check out Betty's Bedding, and there's a link in my description. You can also get 20% off if you want to, but I just, I really love 
love their bedding. Okay, I just wanted to show you how easy that was to make their bed. It's literally the fitted sheet right here and a little like minky filling top sheet on top. In the morning, she wakes up, rolls it, zips it, puts her pillows on it, and bed is made. You guys, genius. And it's so fun, the kids love it. And it's and it's still, it's like such a cute, it's so cute. I know I love that word. It's just such cute bedding. I do. When it feels like you're walking back, when you're out looking off the path. I want you guys to notice something. See how I just put on like the waterproof like sheet thing? Yeah, it's like this is literally all before bed bedding from Betty's. Like how cool is this? All in one and it's super easy to wash. I love the fact that you can just like put it around the bed. And look, do you notice how the bottom of the dust ripple, like the, not the circle, but the bottom of the bed skirt didn't even move. Just remember that you're not alone. Remember that you're not alone. Here is the finished product. Okay, I was gonna show you guys. I put the bedding that matches Betty's. It's just a pillowcase here that matches this. But I originally was going to do gray and white behind here. So funny, I don't know. I just, I keep going back and forth with my decisions. So I was gonna do gray and white with the white pillow and then the pink. And then I have a gray and white du duvet cover right here that I actually need to put the down comforter in it. And I was just going to kind of make it fluffy but lay it across like that. So I was gonna do that, but now I'm not sure. I kind of think I'm liking it just look really simple and girly in here. Maybe put the blanket instead of up here, putting it here. I don't know, I am not good with this kind of stuff, but anyway, I thought this looked kind of cute. This is their room so far. I gotta clean it, gotta put their clothes away. I can't wait for them to come see it. My parents said they're doing great. They're swimming and they're having fun at my parents' house. So that is good, anyway. It's coming together, guys. It's coming together. She's like, don't bother me. I am sleeping. Are you comfortable? Did you find a comfy bed? Okay, and one more feature. I want to show you guys how cool this is. Ready? I'm obsessed. Like, you don't even know how cool that is. <laughs> how happy that makes me. Oh, my gosh. It's just kind of funny that, like, blinds, something like this could make you so happy with a touch of a button. And you can stop them really wherever you want to. So if you're like, oh, I kind of like that look. I think it's kind of cute. Anyway, I'm really excited, you guys. We did it. Three bedrooms done in one day. It took a long time to do that. Plus, I did I did unbox the kitchen. I'm I'll proud of myself. Ours. Look at this. It's a disaster. I can't wait to surprise them. So we started what time this morning? Like... Get up like I, eight o'clock, seven o'clock, eight. eight. Yeah. It's now 11 p.m. Now what time? It's 11 p.m. It's 11. Okay. Well, tomorrow we gotta get this done. I guess this can come last. We can. Well, let's just. I can't wait to show the kids. We lifted up two. You. Well, you, me, and you. You lifted up the washing machine. I'm seriously feeling so good about myself right now, and I haven't even showered, you guys. And you know what? I don't. I'm not. I'm not ashamed of it today. I worked hard. I worked really hard today. Some days you have those. Sometimes you have those days. And yes, I feel gross, but like, I'm not ashamed of it. <laughs> I'm so tired, I don't care. It's like, it should have I know, we're so exhausted. We'll start fresh tomorrow. Yes, we will. And Lucy, did you have fun today? She's exhausted. Too. And she's out. She's like, this has been such an exhausting day. I'm not quite used to my house yet. This is where Corey and I are going to be sleeping tonight, right here on the ground, because I don't have my box springs yet. I think. I haven't covered that already. It's been a long day, so I don't remember. We are sleeping right here on the floor because we don't have our stuff. I cannot wait to show Reese and Perry and Rhett their new rooms and Kesley. I'm so excited. Those will all be up on different videos. I want to get their reaction for each of their rooms. I'm so excited to reveal and surprise them and surprise all of you guys too. It will be awesome. So okay, let's go to bed. No, it's Logan's hand. I tried to decide where I'm putting it, so I put it. I don't know what I'm doing with it. Anyway, okay, let's go to bed. All right, you guys. I look. 
I'm, I caught it for the day. I am. I am going to bed. Love you guys, and we will see you guys tomorrow. Night. <laughs>